Okay, so first you have to go to iCloud.com and then I'm going to sign in with my iCloud ID. Hit enter. And here we are. Now if you are using uh, iCloud for other things, you can actually access it here, much like web access. I uh, don't uh, for various reasons that I discussed before. But it says find my iPhone, but it really, I don't know why this never changes, but it's find my iPhone or my iPad. So I click on this icon, and what will happen is it's going to search for my device. And it's going to tell me kind of where it is in a second. I'm going to show you this. Um, but remember, you have to have your iCloud turned on for the find my iPad or find my iPhone. So it's found me here. I just click on this and I click on the eye. A lot of people get a little bit confused about this. And then it over here it says, what do you want to do? So if maybe, hopefully, I just lost my iPad in my house, let's say, and I click on play the sound, can you hear that? It will play that. And it's pretty uh, obvious that you can go search for that. Click OK. I found it. You can also uh, put it in lost mode. So if I click on this, I can actually say, please call me at my office number, 1-888-587-9062. Click Next. And you can personalize this or just leave it to say, this iPad has been lost. Please call me. And done. And then what happens on the device is it'll actually pop up and say that message. So it'll, if hopefully you have a passcode or password on it, it'll lock it. <laughs> Otherwise, it'll just put it in sleep mode and put this message on it. Now, the third option is to erase the iPad. Now, obviously, you only want to do this in dire situations. And if you do this, you know, you might not consider it, well th think of it now, while well, you actually have your device. Please, please, please be backing up your device through iTunes or iCloud. It's imperative if you want all your information back. So if we were going to erase the iPad, we would click on erase and it actually would warn me that's good and I totally don't want to do this, <laughs> okay? But what it'll do is erase it and with this new from iOS 7 and beyond, it actually won't allow anyone to use that because it's registered to you. So that's a good thing. Okay, so go turn on iCloud for the a very awesome feature that uh, this has been around for quite a while to be able to play the sound, to find it, to uh, find out if you left it at a certain location, uh, you know, a coffee shop or an airport. It'll tell you right here by looking at the green or of course you can erase the iPad.